Today, Kevin and I have an, a, a large assortment a of gummies to try for you. Uh, guess who sent these? Maria. Maria sent these from Berlin, Germany. So thank you very much to Maria. Uh, three of them are Haribo and then two of them are the Lot gummies. Um, from Haribo, we have the Easter basket. And then we have um, Flower Power. And then we have Pearl Eggs, which I can't wait. And then from the Lock Gummy, we have Garden Gnomes and Bunny Crew. So, the first ones we're going to try are the um, Easter Basket. And Maria said, uh, Maria said some gummy candy should always be included in a snack box from Germany. And since Haribo never gets tired of inventing new candies, I will probably always be able to insert some gummy candy. Uh, here we have the Easter basket. Some strong, strong smelling gummies. These are like, uh, they're not gummies, they're like uh, uh, gumdrops. Kind of texture, like the inside of a jelly bag, a bean. Do you she, want to bite these in half? Do you want to? Uh, see if you soft. see if you can bite it in half, or you can cut it with okay. the scissors. Will you tell me what flavors you want? Oh, uh, white. Whenever you're ready. Uh, no, you're fine. She said 25 grams or 95 calories, but you would have to weigh it out. You'll like that. Mm. Ooh. It's like pineapple. Ooh, I like the texture. The texture is like sugary paste almost. Mm. You bite into it, it goes. That is so easy to eat. Mm -hmm. That's wonderful. That'd be dangerous for me because I eat twice as many. Yes, but it's dangerous is, calorie wise. It's strong pineapple, but it is pineapple. Mm -hmm. That is so good. Go ahead. Which one? You pick. Um, yellow. Mm. Wow. I knew that was lemon before I got it in my mouth. Um, I could smell it. These remind me of the babies. Mm. The texture, mm -hmm. uh, what are those babies? Jelly called? babies? Jelly babies. They remind me of the jelly babies. They're, they're a little softer than them, but they're they remind softer. me. They have that little crust on the outside mm -hmm. with a really soft center. Okay, let's go for pink. I'll tell you what, I can't say it enough. I absolutely love the texture mm -hmm. of these. If only all gummy candies for this. Texture. I know, <laughs> but really good. you would be eating it like I could eat these with a spoon, like, <laughs> yeah. really. Some of these shapes, I don't know what they are. I think that's a bunny. I think that's running. strawberry. That kind of tastes strawberry-like. Yeah, it's not like a strong, like, really strong candy strawberry, but I do think it's supposed to be strawberry. Mmm. That is uh, cherry. Cherry. Mm -hmm. Too bad they don't tell you the flavors. No, that is definitely cherry, though. And it is a strong flavor. Purple or green? Green. These, I can tell you right now, I'm gonna put these in favorites. Mm -hmm, they're good. Because they're awesome. And that's before we even try them all. Mm, I like that one too. I don't know what flavor it was, but I like it. It wasn't lime. No. Maybe it was apple? Supposed to be apple? I, don't, I truly, I don't know what it was. I think it was supposed to be apple. Yeah, it's if it, that one was the only one that's like. Mm, I like it. I, there's nothing wrong with mm -hmm. the flavor. It's just like it's not distinctly apple, which makes no sense at all. Mm -mm. But no, I'm not sure what it was. No, but it was still nice. Is this black currant? Oh. Oh, 100 percent. Mm-hmm. I tell you what, if you've never had black currant. It's like a sharp. You will know black currant. It's like a sharp, almost mango-like kind of flavor. Sometimes mm -hmm. it's like piercing, like a. Yeah, it's, which it's, you wouldn't, you you would never know that um, the black currant was just a different way of doing a grape. <laughs> it's so different than grape. It's, it, so, it's so very very different. So if you ever get a chance to try it, you should. And I'm much 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 more used to it 
and would would say, oh yeah, I really like that flavor. And even that, eating that, it still catches me off guard with that sharp uh, sharpness of it. I but would never again, say I would like that flavor. I do not mind it. I don't. I can eat it, but I don't enjoy it. Like if we went, if we like moved to the UK and you can dream right if we ever moved to the uk and we had to give up grape for black currant i love grape grapes like been my favorite flavor forever but yeah. i would i would i could do that yeah but that is not taking place of grape it's, it, it's not it's different. not but i could do it okay these are called flower power they look like something from the 60s they from do. the brady bunch uh, they, they look like those little tough little ropes that you get and they've stuck them together. In oh, like a, uh, yeah. Stuck okay. Them together. You want to do yellow? That's exactly what they are. Those little thin filled mm. ropes. Not bad texture wise. So. The first one I told you get the calories wrong. The first one were 82 calories for 25 grams, not the UK or one iota. The, not um, these are 95. These are the ones that are 95. Um, I have no clue what flavor that was. I think it was, it's supposed to be like a lemon cream. A lemon maybe? It, it's lemon, but honestly, it's more like a lemon frosting to me. It's very sweet, and it, there's a lightness to it, like creamy flavor. It tastes like a creamy lemon cake frosting to me. Now we have the pink. Yeah, these have a creaminess to them. I think that's more like a strawberry cream. Mm -hmm. I got strawberry. Mm -hmm. I don't like these. I think it, oh, I do. Mm -hmm. I could eat a lot of these. I think that's a strawberry cream. I don't like that cream flavor. Now, this is probably going to be black currant. But, you know, that surprises me. Because that white, I think it's delicious. I really love the flavor. I don't know what flavor that was either. Mm mm. It wasn't a sharp black currant flavor. No. I don't know what it was. No, but I couldn't tell you what it's supposed to be, but it's good. Mm -mm. Okay, great. It was a non flavor item. It was very sweet. It was tougher for some reason. Yeah, those, I wouldn't buy those. The green one personally. was a little tougher. And I think it's supposed to be closer to apple. Mm -hmm. That's my least favorite in the bag, but I think those taste terrific. Yeah. I really, I really. Like now, I am very, you don't even know how excited I am about these. Um, Maria went on a hunt for these for me because she sent us an egg for Easter and it was full. It was like just. To me, it, you could just look at it, it would make you happy. Because it was all kinds of Harbo candies. And just like from all different kinds of packages, it was just, it was just very, a very happy egg. And you got all these different colors and um, it was just terrific. Well, my favorite things in this egg were these. These are like, oh, what do they call them? They're called pearl eggs. She said, the pearl eggs you already know from the mixed Haribo Easter egg. I still cannot tell you the flavors for all three bags, but at least you know these ones are yummy. Yes, I do know. And these are different flavors, and you didn't get very many of them, um, of the different flavors in the egg. Um, you got. Are you going to eat a whole one or a half one? Uh, probably a whole one. They're real easy to eat. Um, they are, um, let's see. The pearl are 85 calories for 25 grams. Not that you care, like I said. Okay, let's I'm try the white one first. I'm trying to get two of each color. The white? Mm hmm These, I love the texture though. They're probably a similar texture inside mm -hmm. to the first ones. Mm -hmm. They are. But we hadn't had those first ones. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, we had never had these before. Yeah. 
They're not quite as soft as those, but they're similar. But they're very, very, very similar. Except they, they have those little pearls on the outside. Yeah, I have no clue what part of those, though. Mm-mm. No. The blue. Or the white. I didn't get blues. Hold on. It was white. Do you think those were supposed to be... I don't think there are any blue. They show a blue on the bag, but... I got one. Oh, you got one. Oh, there's one. Go out the bike out there. Okay. They, um... Honestly, it reminds me kind of like a mango type flavor. No clue what that was. Okay. Do you want to eat just half of it? You probably could. I will for the video so we can keep going. Yeah. Oh, I was just being gluttonous because I know I love them and want them. I can eat them later. It tastes the same as the first one to me. Mm-mm. Yeah, it's different. No. See, I'm not getting a lot of individual, like, specific flavor out of I think that one was, like, strawberry. I no. think the first one was more, it reminded me of mango, because there was a sharpness to that first one. That one did not have that at all. Okay, let's go for blue. Maybe it was supposed to be pineapple. The white one. I think that is blueberry. That one does have more of a berry flavor. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yellow. Yeah. That's not lemon. That's mango. That is mango. Mm hmm So I don't know what, that first one still had that tartness to it. So I don't know what that first one was, but that one, that the yellow one in that bag is not lemon, it's mango. Mm -hmm. Okay, you no. know, it settled in pretty decent. It wasn't that bad once I, once I started eating it. You know, I do like the texture of these. Mm-hmm. Oh, they're terrific. Mm -hmm. I literally took that Easter egg last time and picked out every single one of those and ate them. I had like a little pile of them mm -hmm. and ate them all. And then... There was something else I picked next. Anyway, I would... <laughs> she probably thought I would share it with the kids. I probably said I would share it with the kids. Guess what? I ate it. They had so much. Um, yeah, they had a lot. They, they didn't need any more, trust me. I can't tell you exactly what was that... Was that green one was? Mm -mm. Me either. Ooh, this one's nice. Mm-hmm. To me, almost every one of those have a very non-distinct flavor, though. Yeah. It has flavor. I just can't identify the flavor. I think I could if I wasn't didn't have uh, so many other flavors going on. I, I I like the last one the best. The the white one was really good. Mm -hmm. I mean, the white one, the multicolor one was really good. The blue one was, you know, okay. The multi one it reminded me it had a little bit of orange flavor in it. Do you think it had an orange flavor in it? No, I truly couldn't identify anything. Well, like that, that whole package, that would be another one for favorites because... Yeah, the only one I didn't like was that uh, the mango kind the of... The mango? The yellow. I really... I, and you know what? I think I would, between the two, I think I'm still going to go with these as number one. I know, the first ones we tried? I'm telling you, they were incredible. And it's a shame those were only out at Easter. I wonder if they have the same texture and flavor, but they do them in other um, shapes for different seasons, like Halloween. Uh, because those are some that they should make all the time. Okay, now these are the lot gummy. Oh, these are the gnomes. Okay. These are cute. Garden gnomes come in the shapes of gnomes and the following flavors. Okay. You have uh, the green is lime, and the They're mixed though, and the orange is carrot and orange. Okay, just give me a second. I'm sorry. So, is there a green and orange? Mm-hmm. No, okay. no. Probably two of those. Oh, that's because they have two different head shapes. So we switch those out. Yeah. There's four different ones, it looks like. This looks like a shape of a cherry, though. A cherry with a stem. And you would think by it saying yeah, gnomes, it. 
They're like little gnome heads. Like it would have the whole body. No, they're just heads. It's just his head. And uh, they look like, uh, the one looks like a Smurf almost. You know, I thought Smurfs because they have like the little hats that like a Smurf Well, has. some of them just have hair sticking out, like trolls. Okay, so she said uh, they're green is supposed to be lime, orange is supposed to be carrot and uh, orange, red and dark red is supposed to be beetroot and apple. Um, orange and red is carrot and apple. Orange and green is cucumber and apple. So let's just try one. Let's just try the all yellow and green. Oh. Very soft. Mm-hmm. Like the inside of a jelly bean almost. Like so, it. so, do you think that was cucumber or lime? I have no clue what that was. I, I can think, see maybe cucumber. I didn't get lime. I think it was cucumber or lime. I really do. I don't know about having cucumber in a candy. That's all. I don't know about that one. <laughs> okay. This one is... Green and orange. Love the texture. It's supposed to be lime and carrot or, or and orange. The texture of these is something you could keep in your mouth for a while. Hmm. I could see carrot in there a little bit. Kevin doesn't like carrot, like carrot. so he could pick out the carrot. Um, I mean, if I were to eat that and you said what flavor is, I wouldn't say carrot. No. But knowing that it has carrot in there, it's like I can see where that flavor is carrot. Mm -hmm. I taste the lime. Yeah, I get a little bit of lime. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do the purple and pink. The beetroot one. Now this is beetroot and apple. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. I like that one. Who knew I would like beetroot? It's more apple though. Mm-hmm. And that is so sweet. Mm -hmm. That is delicious. That's the best one too. Mm-hmm. That is the best one of the batch. Yeah. And this is orange and I Half. guess pinkish kind of color. I'm gonna go ahead and start pouring these. Okay. I like that one too. Mm -hmm. That orange and pink one looks good. Mm -hmm. I mainly get orange in my piece. Um, yeah, I can see that. Right. These are teeny tiny. They are small. These are, oh, I like those. Just to finish up about that bag, I like the texture of them. Yeah, yeah and the flavors weren't bad at all. Mm -hmm. They, um, they were really nice. I think that adults or kids would like those very, very much. Um, and they're not hard whatsoever. No, they're, they're just very soft. Like I, I said, inside of a jelly bean is what they remind me of. Yeah, they, they really um, did the flavors. I mean, the uh, textures well, and the flavors are good too. And I can't believe I like the beetroot one the best. Yeah. And these are called uh, Bunny Crew. They are carrot and bunny shaped gummies that combine a fruit with a carrot flavor. So this company is making sure you get carrots. Yeah, it's even shaped like, well, okay. I guess it's shaped She like said there was a bunny shape and a carrot shape. Yeah, that looked like a carrot. So we have a red, mm -hmm. a yellow, yellow, a green, green. orange, orange. And pink. dark orange. I guess, and is there a pink one? Uh, orange. Dark orange. She said passion fruit, peach, but I don't know if that's. I guess that could. I mean, that doesn't look anything like orange to me. It looks pink to me. But. See, she said. Uh, she said red is the raspberry, yellow is the lemon. Raspberry, lemon. And then she said green. Yeah. Is. She wrote pear. Pear. Okay. And then orange is orange. Orange is orange. And then she said dark orange. I'm thinking she is passion, passion fruit and, and peach. Uh huh. That has to be that one. It looks pink to me. Okay. okay. So you want to try that one first? So here, hold your hand up. There's a dark. There's a yellow. And these um. Green. Honestly, these bunny characters. It's their heads. Orange. They're kind of scary looking. They got big bulging eyes. They have, yeah, they have big bulging eyes, 
and a big smile. It reminds me if you've ever seen some cartoon characters from like the 19, um, what would it be like the 1920s? Very, very, very early cartoon characters. Yeah. If you've ever played the game Cuphead, kind of reminds you of that. Yep. Creepy, mm -hmm. Yep. That, that's exactly what it is. Yes. Game. Cuphead. There you go. That's what these remind me of. They're kind of scary looking. All right. What color? What one are you going to first? The peach. So which one is that supposed to be? Uh, this one, I think. The peak. It looks pink. It says passion fruit. Peach. Yep. That passion fruit. Mm -hmm. I wanted to get it over with. Mm-hmm. Ooh, these are very, very sticky. They're a little, they're about the same softness as the last ones. Mm -hmm. The numb, they do kind of stick in your teeth a little bit. Mm -hmm. The orange is supposed to be orange. I could do without the passion fruit, ever. Tastes like grapefruit. Mm-hmm. I like the texture of the numbs more. Mm -hmm. And do you think these have something added that makes them stickier? I don't know. They do seem, seem stickier. Mm -hmm. They seem much, much stickier. I would be worried about giving these to your kids unless you, they have a loose tooth and you want it to come out. They're not that, quite that sticky. Um, but... The orange was <clears throat> okay. Not one that I would want all the time. Mm -hmm. Okay, the green is supposed to be pear. I like pear. Mm-hmm. I'm trying to figure out which way these carrots are supposed to go. Is it this way or the other one? That's a carrot shape. But I mean, yeah, I think he goes. But I say pear. Yeah, I think he goes that way. That's what I was thinking too. Um, um, I didn't really get pear flavor. I did, but it was okay. It was just okay. This, uh, then we have raspberry. The red one? Mm hmm. We'll do lemon last. Hmm. Now that reminds me of uh, the fruit snacks you buy mm -hmm. in the cereal hall. Yeah, like the Betty Crocker raspberry little snacks. That's mm -hmm. really, really strong raspberry. Mm -hmm. That's the best one. <laughs> yeah, so that's far. the best one so far, and now we have lemon. They do get stuck in your teeth real bad. I'm switching sides. Mm -hmm. The lemon. Not as bad as I thought it was going to mm -mm. be. It is kind of cleaner like, but. Mm -hmm. It's right there. I mean, honestly, if I hadn't, if it just had a raspberry, I probably would have said that's very cleaner because it's pretty strong. Yeah. Out of the two lock gummies, I would definitely pick the gnomes. Yeah, they were good. But. I wouldn't buy either one of these as long as I could get these. Those two, yeah. I, but you know what? Kevin did not like the flower power at all. No. I thought the flower power were very, very good, and I love the texture of those. So to me, all three Harbos are a win. Yeah, I just didn't like, I don't like the texture or the flavor of those flowers. Yeah, these, this, to me, this was a, a great review. I'm sure some of you got, <laughs> if you've hung in this long, thank you very, very much. Um, this is fun, though, to review different candies like this to see which ones, uh, which ones you like and which ones you don't. And hopefully, one of these days, we'll get these over here. Because World Market, if you have a World Market in your area, they sell a lot of Haribo. Mm -hmm. And stores sell the regular Haribo. Right, but if you want a good selection, World Market's the place for you. So, Maria, thank you so much for sending these to us. I will have a picture for you at the end, and thanks for watching.